What is happening, y'all? Welcome on back. Um, so you may have caught it there in the corner. I got Ash of War Barrage from killing that thing, so a bow, Ash of War. But we're ready to continue. Um, this will probably be our last episode in the Atlas Plateau, or at least close to it. So when we got this, I got this. I don't think there's anything up here. There's definitely something there. Um, yeah, I mean, we're getting, we're getting close. You're getting close. Well, I mean, we have the, the dungeon still. But, um, that's just, you know... That's one singular area versus us, like, exploring the plateau, which is what we've been doing with all of these episodes. The seeds is that... Two, two more seeds to go. So we're going. Oh, wow. We go all the way through these. Well, this might lead up to... That area over there, then. Let's go left first, and then we'll come back and we'll go right. I can already see a fog gate. We got something over there. Ah, oh, so this is where... This is where the lizards have been all this time. Nope, 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 nope. Boys, calm down. We're not playing that game. Is that a... Oh, no, not a merchant. This, this is right here. This is the definitive experience that defines whether or not something is a true Souls game. Is whether there's obnoxious basilisks that try to petrify you and kill you. Oh, bro, I'm out? No! Oh my god, I bought so many keys too. Seathwater Cave, it leads under a dead Erd tree. You know it's probably super cool. Man, it's whack. It's easy to get here at least. Let me mark it. Damn! Bought all those keys and he can't even use them. The dead bodies falling out. Let's see what else is around here. I feel like there's a lot of times where I'll need a stone sword key. And I'll end up finding one, like, somewhere close by. Like, not like, you know, immediately. But, you know, I, I go, I don't know, a quarter mile this way. And there's, like, a, a camp that has a stone sword key, so. Damn. That is a very big castle. A castle. I like to get a legendary sword. When I see a castle, that's how you know that you won't be bored. <clears throat> yeah, we'll keep that on, cause I didn't realize it until I used it in battle earlier. But it uh. Hang on a second. Let me, uh, when I when I use that, it reduces my frenzy back to zero, and it boosts my frenzy resist, which means I can really spam my ability. There. Two more points for endurance. It's a pretty big castle.
cool mace, bro. Can I get it? No. Greedy. Fort L Laid. Uh, Smo, what are you doing here? Lava Smo. Alright, keep walking at me. I can play with fire too. Prelate's Inferno Crozier and Fire Prelate Helm. Uh, literally just fire smell. Uh, does the helm do anything cool? Does this, like... No, it's just a... Oh, look at that. That's... Oh my god. Silver and creepy. Um... Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Plumped and soft. Helm engraved with a sacred countenance and housing a cauldron attire the fire prelates, commanders of the fire monks. It is said the cauldron perched atop the head it was originally furnished with embers and would surge into flames when the wares reach faith reach its zenith. The fire of this cauldron has since died out. Okay, so I don't get fire head, I just get the helmet. Yeah, it's gonna be a no from me. I'll stick with the imp head. I should have wrote down where that was from. I don't want that for the strength build. Uh and what else do you give me? The hammer. <clears throat> Fernand Crozier, CE, 45 strength, physical, slam arm it into the ground to create a surge of flames, then charge in, hold to continue the charge. Hammer's head is unusually substantial and strong attacks will fling foes into the air. Well, we certainly found a potential strength weapon. Troll's hammer, eh, troll's roar, meh. Heart bow. Sonorous tones resound when firing arrows. And it comes with barrage. The scaling is shit. Maybe it levels up and is really good. I want to do a bow. Like, there's so many freaking things I want to do, dude. I want to... I think whenever I, I do my dex build, that'll also be a bow playthrough. Because, like... I mean, honestly, this game's so big, I'm not going to be able to, to do, like, multiple playthroughs. It's just... It, it won't happen. Um... You know, I'm, I'm, I'm guessing, so this is the, well, this, this is very much, this is a faith build. Like, let's be honest, our stats are, well, our stats aren't really 2022. They're boosted right now. But so that's, that's low. Most of our points are going into, to faith. Like, actually, I don't even know from a meta perspective, because we're almost at a hundred. Uh, at a hundred. Oh shit, my endurance is almost at 30. I forgot because the helm. That's still nice though. So yeah, it'd be 45, 24, 30, 22, 22, 9, 36, 15. I'm gonna be bad at 100. And if the meta ends up being 120, my faith could get up to 56, which is juicy. I wouldn't even need it that high. I'd, I'd need it up to like 55, and then I'd probably drop one point in arcane for other dragon stuff. Eek, the wretched fools. Who said eek? They'll never find me. Iris Scorpion Charm, eek the wretched fools. I'll survive, I swear. I'll soon be back at the Volcano Manor. I'm guessing this is another one of those, yeah. Hmm. 
Weird. So that's where we fought fire smoke. Looks like there's stuff over there. We're gonna have to get around. Hmm. Not much here. I mean, well, we killed we killed a, a boss, essentially, and we got a really cool weapon off of it. But the whole, like, eek, they'll never find me, that's... That's throwing me for a loop. It makes me think, is there someone that's, like, hiding here? Oh, shit! Oh, nice. Like, is the fact that I didn't hear them but I saw the text, makes me think it was like, almost like someone whispering, you know? Like, oh, they'll never find me, I'll stay hidden here. And I feel like if we uncover that person, maybe that's a side quest? I don't know. Let's see if it triggers again when we go back up. they'll never find me made me think maybe it was like a um you know like a mimic charm or whatever they're called now the thing that allows you to just turn into an object yeah i'm i am i i do not see anything so i guess we're done um fort need so, Shaded Castle. Let me look for castles in particular, because it seems like castles are where I find legendary weapons. So we had the Shaded Castle. Castle Morn. Was there one castle per region? Is there a castle I didn't spot out here? That's the starting thing. You know, I never did get up here. In, uh, Lenuria. Damn it. Laernia. I'm so close to getting it down. How do I get up there? How do I get up to this place? Because it looks all standalone. It looks like it's a, it's a, you know, a cliff face. Maybe over here. Maybe there's a jumping path. I might go take a look for that. Different episode, though. Um... That's the Volcano Manor Torture Cell. No, that. That's the Happy Time Volcano Manor. Um, let's see. This looks like something. I don't know what the deal is with that text. I mean, honestly, it very, very well could just be a bug, you know? We're playing pre-release. We've had Dragon's Bug, Cauldron's Bug. We've had wolves that instant kill you as a player. Like, we've... We're not new to, to weird, goofy shit. This game definitely has potential to become, like, my all-time favorite Souls game. It's not just gonna get a free pen. Oh, wow. Okay, so I think our marker is way the fuck up there. Uh, let me see. I would need to exit from Volcano Manor, like in the back, I think, to reach that. Which I don't know if I can. Let me, let me check the front for a uh, reference of my height. 
I guess elevation is the more appropriate term here. Um, you know, we never killed that guy. He looked like he was about to do some frenzy shit. Please tell me I get a frenzy thing for killing him. Fuck off. Yes, and if you had gotten here, fight him, you're successful. And you may enter the- Damn, Volcano Manor's fucking huge, dude! I've never, like, just turned around and looked at it. Bro, what? We get access to- This is nutty. What? We get access to, like, the first floor. Look how big this bitch is. This is insane. This ain't a manor. This is a fortress. This thing's bigger than frickin' Stormvale. And this will get me to where I wanted to go. But first things first, I need to kill this little glowy shit. It's a pretty wide sweep. Should connect. Oh, bro. I know it comes past to this guy. Through and through. Is it like a... <clears throat> Let me look at the arch archery stuff just because I do want to do an archery build at some point. Mighty shot. Ready the bow, pull the drawstring, enhance the power, penetrate guards. Powerful archery shot using a great bow. Ready the great bow, twist the bowstring to fire that can penetrate through enemies. That's badass. Barrage, hold it horizontally, rapid fire off shots. Sky shot, low stance, fire an arrow up into the air, arcing it so it strikes from above. Chanted shot, enlivens the air with essence that will fly faster than regular shots and reach its trajectory to follow the target. Kinda cool. I think I got this, because I want to say I, like, left got- Dude, oh my god, it gets bigger the farther you get, Jesus. Volcano Manor is not messing around. And we did get this. Frame City. I love losing frames. Like, why does it do that? It just- like, it, it just fixed itself, but like, damn, dude. I think that's the biggest thing, like... I mean, I know a lot of- a lot of people... ...were like, oh, Elden Ring, that's the only thing that matters. Like, back when I was- I was, you know, pumping out Horizon, they're like, oh... ...I ain't worried about Horizon, Elden Ring's almost here. Elden Ring's gonna be game of the year, it's gonna be the game of the universe. It's gonna- like, people were- were hyping it up into, like, a cyberpunk situation. And I mean, I was... ...excited, based on what I played, in the network test. But I was still like... You know, no game gets a pass, like, show me the game at launch. And, uh, you know, I'm, I'm still, oh my god, I'm still having a ton of fun with it. It's still a great game. 
But like, man, the performance issues are... Mm. Like, I should not have frame issues like this. At all. Okay, so there's stuff up there, I think. No, well, I don't know. My, that's my marker that's blue. Maybe there's nothing up there. This is the this is the full full scale of Volcano Manor. Jesus, it's so fucking big, dude. It's so fucking big. I don't even think you can access it from the front. No, there's got to be something up here because there's a. I don't know. Oh my God, these fucking marionettes. Remove thine self from the cockles of mine offspring creator. Are we are we done the region? Like what did we even do this episode? We didn't do anything, did we? We went down here, that was blocked. Can't get over there. I mean clearly there's like a pathway here and then a thing and then that. Uh, oh god damn, we didn't do the prison town church. I've been running around. We didn't- we haven't even touched the prison town. Wait, prison town church. It's just a church. Probably not a lot here. Uh, so this is the... Calm down. What the fuck, dude? Okay, this guy's done. Little, little real rider bullshit needs to stop. There's, I'm pretty sure this is just the the part of, if I remember, I think I, I go through the volcano manor and it brings me to this church. Sit the fuck down. How dare you? Yeah, this is like, yeah. This is just the, this is the church. Out of my way. Yeah, I remember all of this now. Because I remember I was like going all over and I was like, okay, thing here, thing here, thing here, thing here. And I even killed that guy, so I guess he just respawns. That's the church, and this is a drawbridge. And that's a thing. That's a stake of America. But yeah, this, this, uh... Prison Town might take a minute. Who are you? A long boy. Oh, oh, ho, 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 okay. Asshole.
All right, well, seeing what that dude just tanked, um, this is not gonna be a cakewalk. So let's let's wrap here. I thought I was for some reason in my head I was like, yeah, I just gotta go to the church and grab an item. Like, no, this is a full on a full on zone that I like I forgot about. So, uh, yeah, we're gonna tackle that in the next part. We'll go on over. I mean, they'll easily take as long as as it did to do the shaded castle. I think. Uh, and then after that. Dude, no, I didn't go out here. Can I connect to the other region? I don't think so. No, oh, can I? Yeah, I can get up there. All right, yeah, we'll do that. We'll do that as well. We'll go out there and see if, if that connects. But first, we're going to... So we've like kind of like worked our way around. We've snaked around the zone. And we're close. So, stay tuned. We'll have more coming your way in a bit. And I'll catch y'all then.